I am masters 4 with 65 games or 1 damage I am masters 5 uh, with 70 games 1 uh, support uh, masters 3 with 75 games 1 so as you can see I am pretty hovering around the same ranks with almost the same amount of wins so you can see I don't actually like specifically play one singular role a lot of time with Overwatch people will play one role and they will main that role however with me I'm pretty comfortable across the board with all roles and a lot of heroes just because um, my game sense um, is pretty good because I, lot of, I watch a lot of pro play I watch a lot of streaming uh, I like on YouTube I watch a lot of Overwatch so like I've been playing Overwatch for a long time I understand the game um, so yeah, I think what's pretty much currently the, the masters is my game sense my mechanical skill is probably what needs the work the most uh, I mean even design my game sense isn't like the best um, could I get to grand masters maybe maybe I would like to you know but uh, very happy with with masters you can see uh, this current competitive season I played a lot of Orissa uh, and Cassidy um, I know Orissa isn't as strong as she used to be but you know I've seen a lot of people playing Reinhardt and Orissa is just so perfect to, to play into Reinhardt and for some reason Reinhardt players just refuse to kill off Reinhardt so it's pretty much free wins with Orissa uh, Cassidy well Cassidy is just stupidly strong in the DPS role right now uh, that could change with season 4 with them changing his um, magnet grenade so we're gonna see how he changes um, and yeah uh, in the next season Baptiste really strong really strong you don't actually see a lot of people play Baptiste on console for some reason uh, Sojourner yeah you don't actually see a lot of people playing her anymore but she's still like an SA tier hero yep and then we have Moira I know not the uh, <laughs> most liked support but like yeah she she's the amount of value you can get from her from pretty much doing nothing is insane brig i love playing with brig probably the most underrated here right now i see people like like rank her like at b level like bro i'm ranking her like a s tier she is insane into certain comms and like certain maps she's so strong so strong so underutilized Grigor as well uh sigma diva jungra um, and like here's like win percentages for all of them apparently 100% win rate Ashen Zombra way but like it really matters like Moira like 75 win percent as Moira and I played 7 hours that is insane 7 hours should not have a 75% win percentage uh, break against 70% like 4 hours uh, so yeah I've definitely seen um, a lot of success on support I would say support is the easiest role to play in my I'm not saying that it's definitely the easiest role it's just for me the easiest role is to play support um, I say the hardest role is tank which I've typically described as my main role is tank it's just because as tank you, you, you've got to do so much uh, for that role as only one of you uh, anyways that's enough of looking at my career profile we're not already here looking at that we're here to watch some um, to watch some games uh, let's go back yeah I'm pretty much yeah so yeah, almost a thousand hours yet, yeah, masters, pretty cool, pretty cool, uh, statistics, now, my intent was to show a, uh, to show a competitive game, however, last night, I went on an unranked, like, streak, because I was trying to get some last minute, um, challenges done for the, uh, for the week, I'm not going to get them all done, there's only two hours left, so I was just trying to get some of these done, and I didn't want to play competitive, because it was like, 1am, <laughs> playing 1am competitive is the worst idea uh, ever so unfortunately there are no competitive uh, games to look at and i never play unranked like me playing unranked is like unheard of so i've never seen my career profile look like this before uh, but let's see what can i what can i remember was an interesting game was this an interesting game oh god no yeah no uh, trying to think what could we look at Uh, why not? Let's let's mm, let yeah. If I, if I let's let's watch this one. Let's watch this replay. Who knows? Who knows? Now again, because this isn't competitive, it's not like I was really. I wasn't playing seriously. You know, it's it's quick play. I'm I'm playing to, I'm playing to have fun. So this I don't think is really gonna show off masters gameplay. Yeah, yeah you're not gonna see much masters masters gameplay here. In all honesty. So, oh, here I am, just 
messing up. I find so many people just don't go around knocking everything off. Like, I've, I, every time I load into a game, like, look at all my teammates, they just stand as still. I'm always running around, like, just trying to break everything I can. But uh, yeah, I do like uh, playing Reinhardt on this on this map. This is, a, I would say, a Reinhardt uh, map. Uh, I, I, actually, I don't play a lot of Reinhardt. Reinhardt is actually one of my lesser played tanks, which may come to a surprise because, well, he's such a popular uh, tank, especially in like lower tiers as well, to grind up to the high ranks. A lot of people will be playing Reinhardt. Again, like I'm doing stupid, like idiotic stuff, like charging into their main. Like, yeah, the, the gameplay you're going to be watching isn't the best. Like, I, yeah, this probably wasn't the best game to show. You. I haven't really done much. Why well, so my team was pushing up, so I thought I'd push up, you know. Loses that position, so might as well kill him. Um, yeah, they go Winston for some reason. I don't know. Like, Winston's an okay counter to Ryan. It's not really a counter, I don't know. I don't know how you describe it. Oh, I guess for Sim, actually, they probably went in for Sim. That makes sense, actually. Um, actually, yeah, no, you're yeah, looking at our team composition. Yeah, no, Winston was kind of a good pick. Kenji, uh, Sim, yeah, no, yeah, I see why they did that. Yeah, I probably could have actually saved Kenji there. Probably could have shielded, but I was just kind of waiting for them to push up. I uh, pinned somehow that caught him. So I find that sometimes a pin can be like some of the, like, the weirdest, like radius to grab the pin. Uh, my team actually managed to kind of save me then, um, you know, get me alive as long as possible, but they, um, yeah, couldn't, couldn't keep it up in the end. Um, I go charging back in. Where's my, oh yeah, I see my sim, it is doing a little bit of a sneaky push up here, so I kind of follow through, I kind of crouch myself. Uh, I saw that monkey, <laughs> I thought I was going to hit the monkey, I thought he was like surfing back down to like the entrance, so I thought I was going to grab him, but unfortunately I missed him. Again, like, I'm not really playing seriously, I'm kind of doing like fun tactics. Again, that, that was a stupid shatter, but you know, I, I did it for the fun of it. Um, unfortunately, I get stuck in a blizzard here, so uh, somehow she, I... <laughs> I lasted a lot longer than I thought I would there. Uh, I don't know, does our Genji wipe up here? He gets the mercy. Does he get any more? He's low health, does he? Oh yeah, he gets finished off by him. No. But it looks like our team's our team is clearing up, so you know. And again, like I said, my mechanical skill isn't the best, so I'm still like learning the correct sense. I, I do need to change my um like my iron, not my iron size, but the, um, the crosshair. There we are. I need to change from my crosshairs for most of the heroes. Again, it doesn't really like I'm doing much, but I've, it really, this game, I was just kind of trying to create space. I was trying to get pins, basically, a lot of this time. I was just trying to get pins and try and be like a, like a in, in their face menace. Just trying to push them back. Not really, not really trying to do too much damage. I don't know why he didn't jump away. I'm pretty sure he had jump and cool down. Yeah, look, he had jump there, so he could have jumped, jumped away from that, but he didn't. Again, my team is pushing up, so I decided to charge on it, like in the May, but I, th I don't know if I cancelled it or yeah, the charge ran out. Pretty sure I die here, yeah, I get walled off again. Again, that's me just not really being aware. Again, I was actually playing without any sound. I think that's something else I need to point out, I wasn't playing with any sound, because <laughs> I was listening to music on my phone. I mean, I could have popped on my headphones and listened to music like that, but I was just playing the music from my um, phone speakers. Cause again, this was like 1am. I, I wasn't really caring. Damn, I wish I could, um, I wish I could show you guys like a proper game of mine, of like a competitive. Maybe, maybe I should have actually played a game <laughs> uh, before starting this video, but I just, I don't know. I get funny about playing competitive. <laughs> that was a good bubble. I'd say that was a good bubble. I don't know if he did it on purpose or if it was just by coincidence. That was a bloody good bubble. Because um, that would have been a huge shatter. So good on there. Good on there, monkey. I don't think their mate gets out of this alive yet. There she goes. There she goes. And we get the point back. 99 to 86. So pretty close game. Again, I hold back a little bit. Oh, okay, never mind. I guess it's a light I push in. Sometimes people hide around behind my corner. Uh, I, was, I was waiting for charge, that's why I was holding still. I missed Monkey, unfortunately. Again, like, 
I'm not really, it looks like I'm not doing much, but it's just my presence. My presence of being alive itself is just kind of like a, a, a nuisance to them. Plus the fact they can't really push in. Uh, so yeah, I don't really know how to accommodate this because when it comes to a competitive game, like yeah, I can like talk about team strategy, I can talk about what they're doing, what we're doing. But when it comes to like quick play, I don't know, it's just kind of like, well, just do whatever you want to do really. <laughs> um, so yeah, I can't be as like, you know, in depth with my gameplay as I'd like to be. So yeah, now I swapped to D.Va because I don't like playing right now on this map. Um, because there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of coverage on this on this map, and you kind of need to um, you kind of need to move around a lot. And right now he does have mobility, but it's nothing compared to Diva. So I do like playing Diva. And who are they playing? They're playing uh, Monkey still. Oh yeah, no, and I presume they're going to stay Monkey. So you know Diva's a good uh, counter to Monkey as well. Um, I can't remember. Do we lose this point or do we win? I think we win it. aren't the best. Um, probably could have saved the Genji there. I'm just kind of waiting for them to push us. I don't really want to push them. Again, that was kind of my fault. I kind of left our widow. I thought we were gonna kind of kind of wrap around. I thought they're gonna wrap around with us. But uh, I guess not. I think this is yeah this first fight is pretty much lost so we just kind of back out. No point really trying to contest or fight that. Just trying to build for my team just so they can get through. And I th that's the thing as Diva, I need to really learn uh, Matrix cooldown management. A waste of rockets right then. Really should not have used them. Just protecting my own back right there. Yeah, this, this, yeah. I'm kind of, kind of a lost team fight. Don't really know what I was trying to do then. I wasn't really pushing. Except we, we were like, the problem is we were both very split. There was like me and someone else pushing one side and the rest of the team pushing the other side. So that's kind of, kind of why we lost that first point right then. Um, yeah, a lot of you guys probably thinking this, this dude's masters. This, this dude is a masters. Like I can't stress enough this, like playing quick, playing competitive is like two different games. Or oh, honestly, it's like two different games. I'm just trying to, be, like I'm peeling for break for her to push through, but she decided not to push through, which is like the most annoying thing. So you waste now cooldowns for like someone and they don't. Oh, help out. Oh, that's my cat meow and hopefully they can open the door. Just trying to break uh, Winden's bubble. Just trying to get enough um, shots onto him. Just because, yeah. Again, my team kind of kind of won that fight. I did pretty much nothing. Yeah, well, I've realised in this game I did pretty much nothing. <laughs> so probably, probably not the most interesting from my perspective. I'm just kind of just... I'm just kind of there, you know, just trying to trying to keep my team, a, team alive, really. Not really. Not really doing much. Again, it's just kind of a thing of the tank's presence. Being alive is just more than enough, you know. Better uh, actually cool to be. So, uh, back into the gameplay now. There we are. So, yeah, I saw the drum crack did push. I, went. I did see that trap, but, you know, I thought, why not just go into it just to get the kill. Uh, yeah, I, the brick just was not just healing me. She could have been out of health packs, but yeah, I just I need some healing, and uh, yeah, she she just wasn't wasn't giving it to me. Um, we had a really odd healing duo of brick and Zen. I mean, it works against something like ball in a comp setting, but um, yeah, brick Zen you typically wouldn't run something like that just because the heal, like the healing output is just so minimal. Um, like Zen can only heal one person at a time, and again, that healing isn't the best. Brig, she has finite health packs, and you know, to, you know, Brock inspires. She needs to be hit a target, so you know, it's like, um, yeah, it's not a good um, healing duo. But I think somehow we managed to make it work. Uh, again, again, it's late at night. I just, I'm, I'm, I'm watching this game, but back, I'm thinking, wow, this is some good awful gameplay. I'm showing to you guys, I really. Really, maybe you should have watched and picked out a better, better game. Better game first. I think we'll watch another one. I think we'll watch another one. Hopefully, a little bit of a better one. Because I don't know if yeah, you can't look at the stats, can you? Which is annoying. Oh, sorry. Uh, I just looked at my phone because I'm screen recording the phone because I'm I'm doing like the Xbox like connect thing and it may be a little bit 
lagging in some areas so I, I do apologize hopefully there isn't that many lag spikes um, for you guys um, yeah that was a terrible bomb <laughs> I thought they were going to maybe like pull back from their push and like Morgan push in. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> bad bomb. It was a bad bomb. So yeah, them, I guess I guess that's that game. Really not the best, not the best showcase of my skills. Uh, what about what about this one? We'll watch, we'll watch this one as well, at the uh, end of, if we can, there we are. We'll watch this one as well to, to give you guys <laughs> some, some better gameplay. Now, I don't actually play Ash. This was like my first proper Ash game ever, I think. <laughs> I've never actually really played her, just because every time I've played her, I haven't had a good success. So, uh, again, this isn't going to be the best Ash gameplay we've ever seen. I'm not an Ash player. Uh, like, I don't know, can I view my career profile? Uh, competitive all modes. Time played. Let's find Ash. Where's Ash? Like, it's not like my first proper Ash. Like, I played nine hours of her, but like... Like, my first proper Ash game in a while, basically. Yeah, sorry, I'm looking at my phone screen recording there. It's really, like, low frame rate, so I do apologize about that. Uh, yep. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, right now it looks bad. It looks like bad gameplay right now. Like, I'm just trying to get a feel for Ash, like, you know, using that dynamite and everything. Just trying to get some headshots in. Got a headshot, think of the, think of the, um, the Zen. Tried to finish him off with, with dynamite, but, uh, popped it a little bit too early. Boom, dink, the hand, so he's down. Uh, yeah, well, because he was on fire, that was just going to wake him up immediately, unfortunately. Couldn't finish off the Genji, I think someone else does finish him off for me, though. I probably could have, if I had better aim, I probably could have dinked um, Zen there and killed him. They've got Farrah, somehow I missed Farrah in the corner of my screen there, I don't even know where she went. I, I was hoping he was going to stay around the, the corner there, but he moved him back a little bit. Somehow, I, somehow, again, I'm not playing with sound in this game, so I'm not hearing this Farrah, like, fly up, but luckily our, our hands home, hands I got her. And, uh, <laughs> it's funny uh, how we both, uh, we have two snipers on, you know, Arctic uh, Peninsula. It's not really, you can't really play, you can't really run snipers too well on these maps. I think this is this the best one? I guess maybe, maybe you can run like Ash and Hanzo, but definitely Widow. You, yeah, Widow's definitely not the best for this map. And that's who they've got on their team as a Widow, so. And you'll see this Widow, who she is. Yeah, not good. Yeah, I wasn't too sure. I mean, Hanzo weren't too sure why this Genji went. He's kind of ramped around already. Uh, I didn't actually see their um, Widow. I'm surprised she didn't get me there. Again, I, I don't have any sound, so I don't hear the fight going on over here. I, I throw Bob, very bad Bob placement. I should have placed him to the right, to like the center of the point, so he could contest point and actually, you know, have enemy in their line of sight. Uh, yeah, <laughs> this is really not good gameplay. I really should have played. I wish I didn't play this game, so I, should, I, I could show the guys some of the comp, play, comp games I played last night, because they were a lot better and a lot more competitive and showed off my skill more than these games. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what that was talking about. Uh, that was pretty nice. Got to think of him in there. And then I finished him off. Like, this is a horrible fight. Yeah, th like, God, this is just... Yeah, avert your eyes real quick. Yeah, just, just, just don't look for the next two seconds. <laughs> I would love to do, yeah, I think I would like to do, like, a live gameplay. I do have, like, I probably could, like, record the gameplay through, I have a game capture device, like, I could probably do it for, like, Stream Elements or stream, whatever it's called, but right now I'm doing it through the Xbox Cloud console thing, like, just because it's the quickest right now. Get rid of that notification. So just re-contest the boy, they got their team coming in again. 
That team isn't the best. Oh, I missed a dynamite. How good of me. Um, that probably wasn't the best idea. It could have, could have, could have been bad for our um, hands over there. Yeah, this was. I have no idea what this widow was doing. I, I think this cop played a game, or did it? No, 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 not this part. This part. Uh, no, uh, the clip from earlier cop played a game. Um, and I killed like four of them, or whatever it was. Okay, so that's first point one. First point. First point one. Just shaking up a bit of my G4 right now. I have no idea where this widow is, I'm like, where's this widow? 
Oh, I think actually I absolutely delete her right now. She tries to delete.